Well, we did some uh, situational stuff today and I started out with some uh, long yardage situation. I thought, you know, our defense was moving around fairly well and uh, got some good pressure. So pleased about that. <clears throat> uh, as, a, as a practice went along, we emphasized the kicking game a lot more. You know, we did some uh, kickoff work, kickoff coverage, and things of that nature. And so we'll certainly need that for the spring game. Um, you know, we had some spirited plays at the end. I think the defense probably had the upper hand, and we'll watch the tape there. But no injuries today. Uh, it was kind of a workmanlike day. We're down some bodies, so we were not able to double rep, which <clears throat> we're disappointed. Uh, Repetition is really important for us as far as learning. Uh, but hopefully we'll uh, we'll get everybody back that we need to double rep on Thursday. So, Because you're getting closer to Robin Spring Up, are you getting closer to getting some separation mm -hmm. at, at some positions, like at running back or receiver or corner or anything? Or are you really not getting a good, clear um, picture yet? N after this scrimmage, we'll have a lot more, Robert. <clears throat> you know, we had one, so we made an assessment off that. Probably won't establish a depth chart. We may establish one after this, after this scrimmage, though. And, uh, but we need to practice uh, on Thursday. We need to have good practice. I'm not convinced we made a lot of progress today, but <clears throat> we'll watch the tape. At that uh, strong side uh, linebacker spot up, I know you're down a few guys there, but mm -hmm. just how do you feel like that position is coming along this spring? Um, probably not where we need it to be. <clears throat> um, you know, we've, we're going to continue to look at some of these younger players. Um, the, the guy that has really caught my eye, <clears throat> he's not playing that position, is Adam Pittlepool. And I thought he made a couple of plays today. He ran Josh down once, uh, you know, during the 11-on-11 work. So uh, he may emerge at that spot. Obviously, you don't have Carl this this spring, you know, mm -hmm. recovering from the injury right. last fall. But how do you look at uh, some of what your mm -hmm. defensive ends are doing in practice right well, now? Well, really pleased with Shiloh Windsor. Um, he's got a little bit of a growing pole, but <clears throat> think he'll be back at full strength, but showing some good things. Um, you know, I think there's a collection of some guys. Um, you know, obviously, uh, KP has played uh, quite a bit last year, Kevin Prosser. And, uh, you know, I, like I said, I think Shiloh is doing some good things. And Josiah Hall, Nella's out there. And so uh, we'll continue to look at that group. I think I like Josiah. I mean, he's one of the many walk-ons that you, you and your staff have awarded scholarships mm -hmm. to. And do you see a a big difference in him now, or do you see the same kind of guy that with that same kind of drive before he was, you know, he announced he was going to go on scholarship? Um, same type of drive, mm -hmm. which I think speaks well to his character. Sometimes some guys come in and their main goal is to get the scholarship. And once they get the scholarship, their drive and energy drops off. And we haven't seen that out of Josiah at all. And so encouraging to see guys like that. And, you know, it's another example of us rewarding guys that come in and do well and earn a spot. With Josh, I know obviously he's kind of getting used to a new set of targets, but just him personally, have you, where, I guess where have you seen him sort of fine tune some things since uh -huh. the end of last season? I think uh, a couple of his uh, progressions on his reads and uh, taking the ball, um, you know, on a, maybe a little bit quicker release. Um, certainly he's got tons of ability, but seen some improvement there.